On Wednesday, October 20th, Children's Park in downtown Lake Orion was filled to capacity for the Downtown Development Authority's Halloween extravaganza. Hundreds of kids and their parents trick-or-treated throughout the park while enjoying games, music, and entertainment. In the past, costumed children marched down Broadway Street into the village and trick-or-treated at the local businesses. In 2020, the COVID pandemic forced some major changes to the event, and once again in 2021, the DDA had to adapt to even more changes. Last year, because of COVID, we had to have registration and we were only allowed 100 people. Um, and then this year, uh, we weren't able to close down the streets. And so for safety reasons, all the businesses came down here for a great big party in the park. We had a magician baffling Bill. And right now we have hula hoop entertainers from Blue Crow. And I also have a light up juggler going around from the Stripe Circus. And we have a DJ, we have fog machines as you can see. Um, we have fog bubbles and kids are trick or treating, playing games. It's been a great day. It's beautiful weather and so many families have come out and we're so happy. Despite being confined to Children's Park, numerous downtown businesses set up stations throughout the park to hand out candy and goodies. The response from the community exceeded the expectations of organizers, forcing the DDA to consider possibly expanding the event next year. I hope so, and we're definitely planning on expanding it, maybe taking up that whole parking lot, or next year doing it in the streets. We'll see where that takes us. I am just thrilled. I'm smiling ear to ear. I, I couldn't ask for a better night and just to see so many happy children and families out again has just been thrilling. Next up on the DDA's calendar is the Hometown Holidays Sing and Stroll, scheduled for Thursday, November 18th at 5.30 p.m. with a tree lighting ceremony taking place at 6 p.m. in Children's Park. For more information, visit downtownlakeorion.org. From Children's Park, this is Joe Johnson reporting for ONTV News.